Hi, good afternoon. Uh, this is Shahid Batsha here. I am the business head of uh, Mitsumi Housing Private Limited, and I would like to show you our uh, stall that we've uh, erected and created just in two days uh, for the Ace Tech. And it's a well-planned stall, so I would like to introduce you to the stall that we've put in the Ace Tech 2021. Uh, so the stall basically comprises of three main parts. The first main part is the area of reception and the area where our Mitsumi logo and the Galvastron logo is working on a uh, large uh, TV screen. And this area basically also behind is double utilized as the uh, area for wet uh, sections. This is the drywall area section and also the area where we are having, uh, you know, uh, meetings and casual talks and uh, discussions. This is the lovely, beautifully done uh, 3D structure that we are doing in Agartala. And, uh, you know, uh, this also uh, symbolizes exactly how we are able to create our structure. So, um, this is the steel area the steel uh, bound uh, area and this is the uh, cladded area so you can have a look at both the uh, you know the houses together and the same structure something similar is also available in Kosamba in our factory Gujarat now behind this you will see the drywall sections the drywall sections are the area where we are showing how the drywalling, cladding, everything is happening. Over here we are having one, two, three, four, the different types of cladding sections. Then we have the joist. Here we show how the joist basically the load bearing can happen on which the walls uh, take the load of the next floor. So this if you look at, you will come over here and see, I have shown you over here where you have not only the uh, joist but also a metal deck and you can have uh, you know a PCC with wire mesh and you can have any load on top which is basically of the second floor or also of a water tank we've also shown I don't know if it's available for you to see from here uh, a thick board which is an 18 mm board this is another option which a person can put above a joist where you can you know have the load bearing on a board as well so we've covered nearly everything like if you look at this we've covered the uh, door frames we've covered water pipe areas we've covered wc wb we've covered each and every segment we've also covered x bracings k bracings we've covered uh, you know uh, even small uh, things like how uh, a TV would be fit on our uh, walls, a TV would be hung on our walls, etc, etc. Let's come to this part. This is the business lounge part or this is the full finished part. If you see, it is like a, uh, if you see, it is like a complete house which has got everything in it. You know, it's a, it's a sloping roof, it's got a full finish, paint finish, it has got a window in it and it has got various different accents. As a matter of fact, there is also beautiful uh, couches for uh, our uh, uh, close associates to have a seat or someone to sit and close the, uh, you know, deal or at least get closer to a deal. Over here on the outside, we have shown the stucco finish. This is the stucco finish of the uh, walls, the exterior cladding of the walls. So here we have shown everything which is so close and so, uh, you know, uh, to the point where a person can see each and every detail. Now let's go to the point where the outside cladding is shown, that we have shown on the other side. The outside cladding is also a beautiful point where we've showed various different parts of the cladding. You know, we've shown a wood cladding, we've shown a stucco finish cladding which we've used over here, then we've shown a plasterboard finish, and here we've shown the wet area. We've shown the area where, you know, uh, like the vapor barrier area, where a person can, you know, have uh, uh, his uh, steel structure protected from moisture, which is a very, very good feature. We've also shown knockdown conditions how the material comes in knockdown or semi uh, erected conditions where a person can just build from here onwards and how it uh, saves a lot of time so we've taken care of each and every part over here here we have the uh, roofing where we are uh, planning actually to show you like right from the joist you have the uh, you know connectors over here and now we're going to show you the various different uh, layers that are used in a roof now this we have shown as a slope 
sloping roof we can show you example of a flat roof from here the joist area also but this is the example of a sloping roof where you have uh, you know just the uh, first layer which is the board the second layer is the bitumen the third layer the third layer is the uh, you know water proof membrane and the fourth layer is the shingles so we've kind of tried to uh, show you each and every detail over here if you look from the inside there are the connection details as well shown where a person can see how a sloping roof basically looks like so we have uh, a proper uh, sloping roof uh, detail from the inside over here where you can have insulation you you if you see over here there's nothing welded it's such an open and clean site where there's nothing welded so this is a weld proof rust proof technology and uh, you know there is a thermal insulation which helps uh, not only raindrop sounds but also monkey jumping sounds then there is also air insulation in between that gives you another value for uh, insulation properties such as uh, sounds from the outside we have we've shown you the first finish of a wall you know and we've also shown you how if for example if someone wants casing patti which is like you know a, a small tart uh, wiring you can have an exterior wiring you can have a, a complete uh, in it, a concealed wiring we've also shown you live switches allow me to show you live switches this is the live switches where you can have uh, switchboards like this then we showed you a full finish a paint finish you can also have a look at the various different knocking sounds over here i will just show you some knocking sounds so this is the knocking sound which you can have now we've we've showed you the first finish we've showed you the full and final finish so these are all the different ways where a person can see the interior of the house just like how we show the exterior the interior the roofing the bare metal area the cladding area now let's look at the various different claddings that we have got available come so we've covered uh, you know every part over here where uh, you know the steel structure is shown the steel structure with the waterproofing membrane is shown over here then this is the first layer of the board suppose someone wants uh, just a labor accommodation or something this is just one layer cladding with this uh, waterproofing membrane this is a two layer cladding with a waterproofing membrane and this is the exterior cladding also these are all exterior grade fiber cement boards from here we've shown the other part of the wall which is the inside now the insides basically have a gypsum uh, finish over here so this is the outside of the wall this is the inside of the wall we've showed uh, every uh, area such that a person can know as per his technical specifications how the uh, walling would be and accordingly the costing can be altered we in lgsf technology will not hamper or uh, touch the structural stability the steel structure remains the same but the cladding the various different cladding options make the configuration different and hence the pricing different so if someone comes and tells me what's the square feet rate we can uh, you know alter the square feet rate as per the use or the requirement as well this is the drywall area where we are having the drywalls uh, displayed and uh, the drywalls basically are uh, two types one is a load bearing and one is a non load bearing so uh, the non load bearing would not have these x bracings whereas the load bearing do have the x bracings these x bracings also show uh, that this is a laterally load supported uh, structure and uh, we've also shown uh, switch boards and we've also shown the uh, different different uh, ways where a Uh, 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 the conduits would run through the passage of the uh, channel so this is the way the conduits will run through the passage of the channel through the 89 channel right through the channel and not disturbing the uh, rock wool insulation here we are showing the door frames so uh, in lgsf there is a mm to mm accuracy where a person can you know look at the uh, purchasing the door frames way in advance right enough uh, in the time when it is required the most so you can have door frames of any size in uh, these are the top lintels where you can have a look at how the load is being bared over here how the load is even looked at for uh, the slam of the door you know so these are the various uh, brilliance of uh, lgsf technology now this uh, is a wet area section that we have showed you so uh, from the tile onward from the fiber cement boards onward there are special chemicals that you can use that basically become a monolithic structure right from the uh, uh, the uh, board to the uh, 
the tile and this becomes a monolithic structure where uh, this is a waterproof uh, you know paste where you can have the entire wall area of the uh, uh, bathroom in one particular way now in the corners this is basically a membrane a waterproof membrane that you can put right across the corner so that there is no leakage problem at all absolutely this is a very very brilliant part about handling of the wet areas in any LGSF structure this is one of the best parts where waterproofing is absolutely avoided here we have shown the uh, joist and how the metal deck looks from inside so from when I'm standing in the uh, uh, below part of the structure this is how the metal deck would touch the joist and uh, here you will see that uh, a, a sheet of maybe a POP or any uh, gypsum sheet can basically cover this area and you can have a beautiful bathroom hall or whatever you want you know so your service lines run in between through here so these are the various different connection details. So thank you very much and from this point onwards I think I would like to tell you that we've covered majority of the connection details and majority of uh, the walling areas and how our entire uh, structure basically is in real life action. So you will get uh, to see more and more depth and details as we go on deeper and deeper. Uh, we also have a uh, beautiful live demo house in Kosamba. Uh, where our factory is and uh, you can book a factory visit on our website www.galvastrong.com and www.mitsumihousing.com so i hope you've enjoyed the tour of this uh, beautiful ace tech uh, stall that we have and we'll see you in many other exhibitions in various different different uh, cities and different different things please do get in touch if you need anything more about lgsf technology thank you very much shahid Bacha, mitsumi housing bye bye